Hi, I'm Kanna Campbell from Sugar Mama TV and I'm here to talk to you about travel insurance for iSelect. Ever heard of the phrase, if you can't afford travel insurance, then you can't afford to travel? Well, it's pretty much spot on. Of course, none of us want to get sick or lose our passport on holiday. But unfortunately, travel doesn't always go to plan. We often put a lot of time and money into planning our holidays, but travel insurance is often a last minute purchase. It could be a good idea to take out a policy as soon as we begin paying for our flights or accommodation in case any issues arise before departure. It's important to carefully compare travel insurance options to make sure your policy matches the type of trip you're planning. So what is the best travel insurance policy? Well, actually there isn't a best policy. A suitable policy will depend on a number of factors, including if you'll be taking valuables with you, any pre-existing medical conditions and any risky activities you have planned, such as skiing or motorbikes. International travel insurance can provide invaluable cover if you get sick or injured whilst traveling overseas. The Australian government will not pay for your medical treatment or cover the cost of you being returned back to Australia if something were to happen. So it's important to protect yourself. While many of us never travel overseas without insurance, it's easy to overlook travel insurance if you are staying in Australia. Domestic travel insurance can provide cover for a range of mishaps, including trip cancellations, lost luggage, stolen property, and rental vehicle excess. There are also more tailored travel insurance policies available, such as cruise travel insurance or annual or multi-trip policies for more frequent travelers. Take the time to select a travel insurance policy well before you pack your bags so you can truly relax on holiday knowing you'll be covered for eligible expenses should the unexpected happen.